people. Thank you, sir. Our, our time is well spent now. We have a book. What's the title of the book we have? Please, can you wave it? Those outside, can you wave your book? Can we wave your book? Okay, okay. We are going to go to read a paragraph from those books. Um, those outside, you can wave your books. A friend of mine paid for those books. He said I could give it to you. His name is um, Mr. Teni Eleo Ramo from Abuja and a friend of mine from South Africa, the wheat quote C. He paid for those books that should give 50 copies, 100 copies of this book to you. And that's why I shared it with you. Thank you so much. So if you're in chapter one, what are the key things you can see? Let's read together for 30 seconds as we shut down this program. Let's go. Chapter one, one, two, three. Go! $100 billion. I built a leadership library in all government schools in Africa. From elementary level to primary to secondary, colleges of education, polytechnics, and universities in Africa. The leadership library will be different from the school's library. It is not designed for every student, but for selected students. With becoming the answer to the cry of many. It is a library that we have books from great, inspiring, and innovative authors who, through faith and patience, subdued kingdoms. The library we have books leadership, creativity, financial intelligence, discipline, characters, competence, honesty intelligence and teamwork and makes the students come assets in their generation. The library will encourage, empower and the generation to create an environment that work in Africa and build in the innate courage to students of truth and what is right in order to make the concept better. Thank you. So what are we going to say? As we round out the program, over to you. Thank you, everyone. It's a photograph section. We're going to take pictures. Thank you, our distinguished guests.